time down here at the beach today, y'all. Getting ready to do some metal detecting. Check out this place. All kinds of people out here. Also have my scuba equipment. So we're gonna dive on in the water and see what we can get.
I'm going to be using the Sea Hunter Mark II metal detector today. This is a pulse induction machine, works very well in salt water. I got the diving shaft on there. Yeah, I got a few coins. And I got a ring or two right there. Nice. So I'm going back in to see what else I can find. Yeah, you never know. Yeah, you never know. You might find a or something. Yeah. I had to dig a pile of trash though. Trash everywhere out here. It's crazy.
So I'm back in from the beach, y'all. These are all my good finds from today's hunt. I'd say I did well, just for coins. Got a little over $3 and just quarters right there. Most of them have been in the water a while. They're tarnished, but some of them are actually fairly new. Found one in there from 2021. I think it's right there. Look at that, y'all. Looks 100 years old, but it's from 2021. That's crazy. Also have these really corroded pennies. I believe that's what they are, just zinc pennies. They corrode a lot in salt water. So it looks like a thousand year old coin. I mean, I guess they could be. <laughs> that's crazy, y'all. Look at this one though. This one right here, like a ball of clay, but it's definitely a coin. It beeps on the detector. Not like a penny. I got some nickels, some dimes, and more modern pennies. Look at that one there. It has a colorful patina on it. 2020. So did good on the coins. Got a little bottle opener. And down here, have all the jewelry. Check that out, y'all. Not bad. This right here, I believe, is gold. If it's not, it's really shiny brass, but I think it's marked right there on the top. It's a little gold star. And I have a silver earring. It's marked 925. This ring here is missing the stone, which is too bad. That would have been nice. But I don't think it's real anyway. It's like stainless or something. It's not gold. Now this ring is definitely the find of the entire hunt. Look at that right there, y'all. has a diamond in it. And it is marked on the inside, 14 carat. Let me see if I can zoom in. See that right there, y'all? 14 carat marked on the inside. It's got a stone right there. That diamond might be real. So that's really cool. Got another earring. This one here is silver. You can see it's tarnished. And then I've got this thingy, my Bob, which I found last minute with the detector while I was walking off the beach. I don't think it's real gold. You can see it's coming off there, but still interesting find. Here's all the trash, y'all. I definitely cleaned up the ocean again. And this is just an idea of some of the stuff you'll come across if you ever decide to go metal detecting, whether it's on land or underwater. You gotta dig the trash to find the treasure. And these pull tabs right here, they give a similar signal as a gold ring. So that's why I was digging them. I also found this thing right here, y'all. Not sure what it is, but it's kind of old. Maybe a brooch off of something. And that was the design right there. So that's pretty much it, y'all. Really hope you enjoyed the hunt. I can't wait to get back out there and find some more treasures. If y'all enjoyed this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. 
Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Until next time, y'all have a good one, and God bless.